we both participated in creating your own superhero. So today we're going to have you share a little bit about what you did. Okay. And I'm going to put it on mute and I'll let you guys go. Sounds good. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> All right, so Alex, do you want to start us off? Okay. Should I download it? Um, nope, you're gonna just stand in your spot so you can move back. Make sure that you can see yourself in the video. Welcome to our second grade Pokemon classroom. Who's next? Really loud. We are coming to you live at Rapture Elementary School. Really loud. Something we would like you to know about our classroom is we have 24 people in our class and our classroom theme is Pokemon. The name of our superhero is Water Kitty. The idea for our superhero came from both of our scissors, which we messed them up and made Water Kitty. We are most proud of the imagination because we were together to build a superhero that was great. The name of our superhero, the name of our superhero is Spider Bat. The idea for our superhero came from spiders and bats. The name of my superhero. The name of my superhero is Joseph the Cat. The idea came from Rufus too. I am proud of thinking of this because if my mom was here, she would be proud of me. The name of my superhero is Gator Boy. <laughs> The name of my superhero is Pikachu. The name of my superhero is Mustang. We have both superheroes for people. The superpower that was used the most often was other. The superpower that was used the least often was fast. The gadget. The gadget. That most of you had was a gun. It's made out of iron. We want we want you to know this because the that he can't die because he died. We want you to know about this because she already helped me. Thank you for listening. I'm super dead. All right, thank you, Mr. Feist class for sharing. My kids are gonna come up and stand in front of the computer and share their bits and pieces. So Alana's up first and she's gonna say hello. We are at Stony Brook Elementary. It is about 10 miles away from you. It takes 20 minutes to get there. We are one of seven thir third grade craft classes in our school. We have 21 students in our class, nine girls and 12 boys. Our classroom has a first and second grade class on our team. 
We love tech, STEM, and coding, and robotics. We hate paper. My superhero's name is Spy Flowers. My idea was of nature, and I like flowers. I am most proud of that I got accomplished because I was having problems getting on something. Our name is Ninja Woman. The idea was Bionic Woman. We accidentally said her name wrong and found it funny and went with the idea. We are most proud of the way we work together and finish before the deadlines. My superhero's name is Big Fat Sheep. I got the idea from Minecraft, and um, I, um, I'm most proud. Of, uh, I'm most proud of the part that is fluffy. What's up next? Rowan. Sample superheroes: Stormfighter, Tornado, Cyclone. Molten Man. Five people had people superheroes. Two people had animal superheroes. One alien superhero. And five other superheroes. Superpowers. Used it most speed. Used it less water. The most common place our superheroes lived was a, was a farm. Most popular gadgets were belt and sword. Next. My class, make sure you're talking nice and loud so they can hear you. One thing we want you to know is that rocks aren't always bowing. Their superhero's name was Brock the Rock. <laughs> Our superhero's name is Tornado Cyclone. We are proud of um, um, making him a sidekick. The sidekick's name is Venom Killer. He is a cobra, um, he got struck by a radiated lightning, and um, and he got this irradiated, irradiated filled rattle um, that if you touch it, you become radioactive. All right, that was it for our sharing. Okay. Could you, could you hear our class okay when we were sharing? We could. Do you need us to repeat anyone that you were having some trouble hearing? No, you guys were okay. I just wasn't sure since we were.